Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and this is episode 16 of Let's Play Japan in your Open Nervous Hallows 4. This has got to be as far opposite of Aragon as possible. We have been peaceful from day one. We had our first war in the last episode it was against the One Province Miner. We didn't do shit. So this is cool. This is a different way to play the game. You don't have to be aggressive. You don't have to uh, expand and get aggressive uh, expansion penalties. You can be peaceful uh, and and still do really well. We're having fun. We already completed our first um, idea tree exploration. Working on our next ones. We just took our first idea, Noble Knights. Now, a long way to go. We're going to get some nice bonuses as we move along, especially this last one, which is military tech cost minus 10%. So it's going to be cheaper to upgrade our army. It's going to be great. I love it. Uh, what's up over here? All right, that's fine. We just killed some rebels. Killing rebels is great. How's Mr. Explorer, man? He's fine. Oh, we don't have a leader. That's right. Now, let me finish getting our next tech. We're almost to our next tech, which will increase our colonial range by 115. Once that's done, we will go ahead and get an explorer and keep on exploring. But until then, there's no reason to. Diplomat is back from uh, Champa. Great. Hopefully it'll just peace out without taking any land from Divea, yet, but that's not very likely. Actually, we might be able to click on them and enforce peace. Does that work? No. You need to be able to declare war on the target. All right, well, dive yet. Enforce peace. Enforce a white peace between the target country and one of its enemies. You will join the war of the opposing side if the target refuses peace. Uh, yeah, let's enforce peace. See how this works. No. Invalid target? You don't want peace with them. You're getting your ass handed to you on a platter, and you don't want peace with... Oh, god damn it, Divey, yet, you retard. We lost a claim on Wasuli. Oh no, not a claim. Whatever will we do? We have our wonderful first vassal, our first non-Japanese vassal up here, Manchu. We uh, can't annex them until, well, seven years from now, so that's fine. No rush. Back on the boat with you guys, you scoundrels. Let us head... I uh, don't really care where we head. Let's go back to Japan. Because we can. Mm, we are almost ready to start colonizing up this way. Oh man, I can't freaking wait. Just come up here and cock block Russia. Oh shit, yeah. They already formed Russia. Look at that. So they have... Uh, what are you? Mogilev? Palatsk? I think Palatsk is one of the ones they needed to form Russia. They didn't get Kiev or Chernigov or anything, but that's okay. They can do it with Polotsk. And now we can finally get 115 bonus colonial range. Great. Now, does that allow us more range in here? Oh, yeah, it does. Nice. All right. Get the fuck out of here. Get out of Dodge. Wait, where are we? We are in Papua and Maya. Yeah, get out of Maya. We're going to move your ass over. I want here. Yeah, we'll go here. It's fine. Actually, how many morons are there? I might be able to split you up. Only a thousand? Yeah. We'll definitely split you up. We'll take uh, two guys to go over there. Perfect. God, you guys really want a fucking alliance. You guys are terrible. I was interested when you, you know, actually were able to defend yourself, but right now you're pretty useless. And we can almost tech up our admin again. Great. Master of Mint has died. No! He was bringing our inflation down, and now it's going back up. God. Oh, we need a Master of Mint. There isn't one. Okay, National Tax Modifier. That will do. I really would prefer a Master of Mint, though. Hmm. 
Military treaty. Gain military power. I like it. And we core Jugger. Great. That's brilliant. We'll wait on that core until we have our tech up. We need one more month or two more months. Oh my god, they're actually beating Oman. They're beating the Mamluks. Look at Oman. Holy sh- Oh god, they have to form Arabia. Come on, form Arabia. You can do it, Oman. You can fucking do it. Will you peace out over here? Just peace out. Seriously. Oh my god, all these freaking. No. Why is it invalid target? Oh, I have to click on him. I have to click on him. And he says no. Can't send it. If a country is losing a war, they can't be forced to make a peace. Ah, they have to be winning by at least 25%. Interesting. And I can't force Champa because we have to be able to declare war, and we can't because they're, they're our um, ally. Hmm. All right, well, whatever. Let's spend some dinero. More temples. Uh, temple in Taiwan, temple in the Philippines, why not? Oof. Oh shit, we spent admin power. Fine, we might as well core this shit then. I forgot temple takes admin power. Nah, it's fine. Yeah, you guys are staying up late. It's only uh, 5 p.m. for me, so... I'm all good. Persia collapsed again... And look at Baluchistan, surviving. How are they surviving? That's crazy. And the Mughals exist. Is this the Mughal Empire? I guess it is. That's odd. That's very odd. <laughs> Whatever. All right, how much tech do, or how much power do we need for tech? Hey, Iraq is back <laughs> in one province. Yeah, not doing too hot there, Iraq. Oh, uh, tech, 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 tech. Almost there. Nine fifty, nine sixty. Oof, it's expensive. Nobles want privileges. Lose prestige or national revolt risk. I don't want to lose any prestige, so fuck it. Revolt risk. Not like we ever really have any revolts anyway. We're so peaceful. Brunei declared war on Patani. Okay. Oh man, look at this. Dai Viet even has pretender rebels in their capital. Wow. And Ayat Haya is invading Champasak. That's always good. Man, look at the Ottomans over here. Holy shit. Whoa. Oof. Oh, that's Tripoli. Tripoli owns Libya. Wow, I've never seen Tripoli expand. I've never seen them do anything. Awesome. It's great to see people actually doing stuff. Unexpected things. Oh, that's right, Mr. Explorer Man. Uh, we can get him now. We can also tech up. So this is going to get us courthouses, workshops, and uh, we've still got a long way to go for more ideas, but that's fine. All right, let's get you a leader. And he's got three maneuver. Oh, man, this guy's going to be badass. He's going to be a ninja. Come on over here, Mr. Ninja. There you go. Do that. And then go dock up and wake. There you go. Try not to die. You know what we can do now? If we really want to, we could definitely colonize uh, the Andamans. We still can't reach the Maldives. But we could colonize the Cocos out here. 
Oh, we can even colonize Australia. Look at that. Nice. Oh, brilliant. And we gained a core in Sumbawa. Fantastic. We now have Coffee Core. Uh, what was our mission? Fortify Shagalan Ola. Ola? Ola. Build it. Okay, killed the rebels. Great. Let's do some more temples. Oh, Explorer is doing great over here. Barely taking any damage. So far. And he already discovered oh, most of the stuff. You know what? Get one more province. Please. And then we'll let you come home. Maybe. Hey, there's the Maya. Look at the Maya. They took over the Zapotec and the Inca. I mean, not the Inca. The Aztecs. Wow. Look at the Maya. Goodness. Oh, they have gold. Oh, they have gold. I guess at this point, I don't really like gold. Gold gives you so much freaking inflation. Ooh, reduce inflation. There's a button. You need to have unlocked all the economic ideas before you can spend administrative power to reduce inflation. You don't have enough... You need 200. Ooh... Oh, I like that. So, the first administrative idea we go for... Oh, man. I would love to go innovative, but economic will let us... Yeah, I guess we have to go economic. When fully unlocked, you gain the following additional benefit. May reduce inflation with direct action. Yeah, that's uh, probably better than the extra tech we get. All right. We're going economic with our first uh, administrative idea. You know what? Give me one more province, or more sea tile, please. You're just awesome with your frickin' three speed. And of course we have, uh, uh, causes belly on them, no problem. So we could come over here and attack them, but we wouldn't be able to core it. Because it's too far away. Hey, Acapulco and Guatemala. Nice. Let's go back up here real quick. See if you can discover anything. Oh, yeah. Mishtech, nice. Keep going. Nice. God, this guy's good at discovering stuff. Alright, let's go home. Let's go be safe. Try not to die. And uh, that'll do. How are we doing here? Still got a few years. Five years, I think. Discovered Karenga. Okay. Can we reach it? Yes, we can. Oh, my goodness. Oh, this is just great. Do we have any more military derps? Uh, let's do 2k. Can we afford another colony? Yeah, I think so. Let's take a quick look at how much these two cost us. Colonial maintenance. These two, Maya and Alden. Maya's cheap, but Alden is expensive. 5.33. Hmm. I'm not sure I should risk another colony. I think five is going to be too many. That's what she said. Uh, but we can reach the next one which is nice, and it's very low population, so it should be easy to take. All right, we'll just be patient. More temples. Colonies are very expensive, my goodness. Okay, are you guys at peace yet? Nope. Nope. Alright, we'll just keep uh, improving relations. And same thing with Sri Lanka, please. Can we marry you yet? Nope.
one step at a time. Hey, we cored Okinawa. So now we can actually convert them. They are the wrong religion. So this is the first time we actually have to hit this button. Convert those animist bastards. Make it so. How's Sunda doing? Pretty good. And Papu is doing well as as well. Good, good. Uh, we can build another temple. Let's do it. Brilliant. Shit, Champa did get one more province. That means we can't vassalize them peacefully. Fuck. Yeah, they're, they're one province too large. Damn it, Champa, why would you go take land like that? You little dickhole. Stop improving relations with them. We can't do shit with that. Fuck. Oh well. Same thing with Majapahit. They are they have four provinces, so we can't actually vassalize them peacefully. We'd have to go to war a little bit to uh, to vassalize them, which I guess might be worth doing. I just I want to see if we can do as much as possible without being aggressive. Hey, we finished a mission to fortify Saghalain Ula, so we get one manpower. Nice. Next mission: turn Sunda into a city, repair relations with Korea. Yeah, let's do Sunda into a city. Great. All right, what options do we have now? We could do Militia Act, Mining Act, School Establishment Act, and we need Admin 17. <whistles> admin 4. And Nationalistic Enthusiasm and International Nobility. Would do what? Missionary Strength goes down. Tech Cost goes down. Oh my god. Ooh. Increased Innovative. Oh, it's only for a few years. It's only 10 years of better tech. And it means at the end of the game we would have crappy production efficiency. No, it's not worth it. It's only 10 years of better tech. Not worth it. Combination of natives with Papua. Nice. They lose ferocity. Not like it matters. They haven't attacked us in forever. Because we have our colonists there. All right, hopefully we'll finish up one of those soonish so we can keep colonizing up north and cock block Muscovy. <laughs> That's definitely high priority for me is just blocking these fuckers. If we could get these two, that would block them entirely. But I think this one's out of our range. Irkutsk? Yeah, it's just barely out of our range. Oh, oh well. Smugglers running rampant. Stop them or it's too expensive. It's only 10% national tax and trade. Mm, yeah, it's too expensive. Fuck it. Still making money. I don't care. Alright, what do we want to do with our, our spare Diplo? We really can't do much. We don't need to do anything with Manchu. They have that huge bonus for relations. Lost a claim. I don't care. Uh, we can't vassalize the Mongols because they're not a kingdom. Madurian nationalists. Well, if anything spawns out of these rebels, maybe we can vassalize that. We'll see. And these guys are Muslim, so we can't marry them. Shan is Buddhist. We could do Shan. They have, what, three provinces? Yeah. I'll consider it. <laughs> Bengal is down here with one province. That's all they got left. I got shit gone. They're like, well, things were going good for a while, and now they're done. Poor guys. Hey, Ukraine took over half of Crimea, you bastards. Okay, we can't even improve relations with Ceylon any further. That's as good as it can get. Uh, so let's see if they want a marriage now. They do not. So we're going to have to pick a rival to uh, get them on our side. Let's keep Champa happy. Mm, we chose Makassar. So who do we have right now? Makassar. 
Ming and Coria. I'm not sure we need Ming. Who do you have? You have Coria, right? Yeah, Coria. All right, let's get rid of Ming. We don't need that. Remove. And let's pick one of you guys. Who you got? You got Vinod and Ahmednagar. Let's do... Let's do Vinod. There we go. That cost us 10 admin power. Whatever. So that should bump up relations. Boom. 130. All right. And we converted Okinawa. That was fucking quick. They did not last long. They still don't want a marriage. Oh my god, we're, we're so fucking close. Oof. Distance, you know, diplomatic reputation is hurting us a bit. No, it's not. It's at plus seven. Or it's at plus five. All right, well, they don't want it. That's fine. We'll just have to wait until we colonize a little closer. If we can colonize the Maldives, that should be plenty close. Or even, um, even the Endermans should be fine. Should be fine. I'm hoping. Bribe them? Ah, eh, I guess. We could throw some money at the problem. The problem is the money is just a temporary fix. Uh, sure. They still don't want a marriage. The bribe was not enough. <laughs> We discovered iron. Yes, I think that's our first iron province. No, we have we have another one. That's right. Oh, rebels! Kill them. Nice. God, they die easy. We do have one iron province. Where's our iron? You know what's silly about the trade? When I zoom in, it doesn't actually show me the trade goods. That bothers me. I wish it did. Is this going to show me trade value? Uh, no, it still doesn't show me the trade goods. What the fuck, man? Show me the goddamn trade goods on the map. Please. Ugh. Nah, whatever. Oh, yeah, so where does this come from? That comes from Mexico. Mexico goes directly to Japan. That is crazy. And what's this? California. California goes to Mexico. And that's it. And it looks like, yeah, Hawaii is part of California. Yep. What about these islands? Trades through the Philippines. Okay. God damn. That's some crazy shit. We need some more... Um, we need some more merchants so that we can actually spread out our, our income from trade. Because right now it's very centralized. Oh, did our, did our dude die? No? Our explorer dude? Oh, there he is. He's fine. All right, wait till the end of the month. Great. And go back over here, Mr. Three Speed Explorer. Whoa, he wants to go the other way. Are you kidding me? Look at this. He wants to go around Africa and all the way up there. Oh, it's because I clicked on the wrong side of Panama. You're sorry. Hello? Hello? A uh, career? Why am I not seeing his fucking pathing? Oh, there it is. Fucking hell, game. Look at that. You go this way, it's it's there. You go this way, the pathing's gone. Uh, I'll just click on there and hope that he actually goes somewhere. Yeah, Bay of Costa Rica. Okay, I can see it now. He's actually going to go Bay of Costa Rica. It doesn't show the line, but it shows up here. Gulf of Darien. No, this side. Gulf of Panama. Perfect. Go that way. Stupid, stupid pathing. Hopefully they fix that. That's frustrating as all hell. Diplomat is back. Good, good. Uh, can we marry? Nope. 65 out of 66. <laughs> oh, goodness. No guy collapsed. Oh, goodness. No, not no guy. And now Russia's giganticer. Stupid Russia. Manchu loves the shit out of us. Champa loves us, but they're too big to vassalize. Yep, negative 1,000 because they have more than three provinces. Otherwise, they would be interested. Yeah. They may not say yes, but we might be able to twist their nipples enough to say yes. 
There we go. We discovered more shit. God, this three speed or uh, three maneuver uh, explorer is just fantastic. Three speed. Oh man, look at that. He's discovering everything too. The moment he shows up, he just he just knows everything's there. He's like, uh, that's it. God damn, this guy's great. Alright, one last shot down here, and then let's go back home. Because you're going to start taking ass loads of attrition. There you go. Wake is almost a core. Oh, man. And then Hawaii, and then California, baby. Probably Baja, California, but whatever. Any California. Copper. Oh, man, yeah. There's some good shit up here. Iron and copper. Oh, man, that's some lucky rolls there. I like that. These are valuable materials. Oh, yeah. Supply at 50%, demand at 65 Ooh, nice. Let's see, which colony is going to finish first? Papua. Papua is going to finish eh, relatively soon. Koch is independent. Okay. And the Oirat Horde has invaded Ming again. What's it this time, Oirat Horde? Oh, they're Buddhist. Ooh. I forgot about them being Buddhist. Anyway, what is it this time? It's an invasion of the Ming. Yep, Oirat Horde reconquest of Baoding. Alright, whatever. I don't want to get too kissy-kissy with the Oirat Horde, because they're going to start going to war with Muscovy, and I'd rather not be on Muscovy's bad side, to be honest. We're already on their bad side, but... You know what I mean. We don't have to be on the bad side. We could be the good boys. Be nice to Muscovy. Or we could just invade the shit out of them and go conquer all the way to St. Petersburg. I don't think anyone would mind if we did that. Except, I don't know, everyone. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Nepal gave Kathmandu to Awesome in a peace deal. Awesome can't even walk there because they don't... <laughs> They don't connect. That's a little funny. And Bengal got their capital back. Great. Mm, yeah. 64 out of 66. Not going to happen. A lot of shit going on in Europe that we just can't see. France is scary. That's pretty normal, though. Assimilation in Sunda. Gain 100 in Sunda. Nice. You go, Sunda. You go. Eat the motherland. Yeah. Yeah, I just don't want to waste admin power on stability. Stability gives you all sorts of great things, but it also really slows down your teching. Like, super duper slows down your teching because you spend all your admin power on it. Always. Constantly. And that has retarded our, our admin to the point of, you know, almost complete negligence. We were at level 2 admin for the longest freaking time because I kept bumping stability up. And I just kept doing it, and I kept doing it. And finally someone said, Chen, just stop doing it. Stop bumping stability up. You'll be fine at stability 0. And they're absolutely right. And now we've been able to tech up. And teching's important. It really is. There we go. Rebels. Nice. Vietnamese patriots. That's what we need. You go turn into Dai Viet land. And, um... Yeah, they won't even come south, because that's not a Dai Viet core. Do that, and then we can vassalize Champa. Everyone wins. Except Champa. They get vassalized. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Madurai has spawned. Alright, are you, uh... Yeah, you're Hindu. Great. Uh, you don't want to marry, though. That's fine. Uh, let's start improving relations with you guys. Great. More little morons we can vassalize and conquer peacefully. Yeah, Russia is eastern. Uh, they may try to westernize at some point, but they may not. Going from... I don't know. Where's Russia? Russia, Russia. Yeah, they're eastern. Going from eastern to western is not a huge jump. It is significant, 
but it's not a huge jump. Uh, it's more of a jump going from like, you know, Chinese to Muslim or Chinese to Eastern. That would be gigantic. Oh, Comet sighted. Haven't had you in a while. Welcome back, Comet. Yes, we've just been blind for the past 10 years. And we are out of time, so thank you for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Join us next time, where we will continue to cockblock Muscovy by... Oh my god, there they are. Look at that. We will border Muscovy as soon as we colonize Karenga. Hopefully we get there first. Otherwise, we could be up shit creek without a paddle. See you then.